welcome back to another game of Magic the Gathering Arena, folks. I uh, am in game two, playing Selesnya Yorion against uh, Boros uh, Enchantments, or Boros Tokens. Uh, he's running Outlaw's Merriment, Felidar Retreat. I just screwed up and didn't go get a land last turn. <clears throat> I remember to do it this turn. So, uh, they beat me in game one. Wasn't anything I could do. Uh, let's go get that out. The trail going. He just, uh, the token generation just overwhelmed me. So I sideboarded in glass caskets. What? That's not tokens. <clears throat> right. Cross Casket, Heliod's Intervention, my other two ECDs. Yeah, I know you're gonna kill him and get a 3 3, woohoo. Mm, too bad I couldn't take care of the 3 3. He was running Selfless Savior, uh, Stomp, obviously. So, I don't know, it may be a brew that they're running in Platinum. But, I mean, it beat me. He costs four. Perfect. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Probably should have Skyclaved instead. That might be a plain mistake on my part. And he was actually main board. Whoa. He was actually main boarding uh, uh, Soul Guide Lanterns. Yeah, so that was a play mistake on my part. I, I should have I should have shot that already. So he may already have this because I don't have an answer at the end to that. I wish this thing blinked anything. I could have blinked Vanishing Light. Alright, so we'll crack the food and dig with a trail of crumbs. And then I'll just jump block with the Charming Prince. Or get shot in the face. So this isn't really tokens. This is just... I guess Boros mid-range is what this guy's running. So maybe I overreacted bringing in the Heliod's interventions. Mmm, yeah. Thank you. Who do we want? I can't hit anything with that at all that he has on the board, right? Yeah. So let's get uh, the Charming Prince. Plus one. Let's uh, scry. Uh, this card draw. have one in hand. Let's do it that way. Okay. Kill him right away, I can start the loop. 
between him and Yorion. See, now he's confused. I probably should have left the little Yorion in play, that way I could have hit with him, but I thought maybe I could uh, blink the Charming Prince in the Trail of Crumbs again. But I think he's going to waste his turn. Yeah, he's going to waste his turn killing him. Okay. Uh, we're going to blink. Definitely not blinking, man. She might. <laughs> Alright, so, uh... Double card draw, baby. Double card draw. Land. Oh, yeah. Uh, swing batter. I forgot he came back in on their instep, so either way, it was good. Got double food for the Wicked Wolf coming up. <clears throat> this game's looking... I feel like I'm in good shape on this game. Oh, snap. What? What is this guy running? Seriously. You know what? We're gonna put a Skyclave out. I don't want to put the wolf because I want to be able to kill something. Do I have enough mana to cast all of it? No, I do not. Uh, I will do that. I don't want to... Do I want to... Yeah. Let's eat a food. Excellent. Excellent. My turn. Vanishing lie, one of them. <laughs> mm. Yeah, sure. Look at Wolf. getting access to that permanent ah uh, okay permanent So what does this guy? Protection from each converted mana cost other than two. Protection from each converted mana cost other than two. Well, that complicates things a bit.
have no answers for that at all. Nothing. Glass gasket doesn't even take him off the board. So at this stage of the game, that's just a wall for him. I can't even I can't even else the bunker's death him. Oh he didn't. What oh okay. that, hey that's fine. That is fine. Take your wall that I can't do a thing about off the table. That was real smart. It was actually not a very smart move on his part. Um. <laughs> you know what? Let's just do it. Well, at least he has a theme, Giants. Let's get my goose out as a 1-3. <laughs> Let's get my goose out as a 1-3. <laughs> Let's put another trail of crumbs on the board. So if I have to get a wolf back, I've got three food for him. Uh, nothing else I can cast. So, we'll end the turn. Please don't drop a soul guide lantern, it's all I ask. Okay. More targets for ECD, so I was definitely not misjudged to bring in ECD. I'm gonna go... I'm gonna eat a food. I'm gonna kinda stack one. I'm gonna see what I got coming. Auto pay. Oh, do I want double car? I got answer again for her. I don't. I don't need the vanishing light. <clears throat> My turn. Okay. Well then. Um. Yeah. You did. I don't even have to war rely on answers in hand. Um swing with my two gooses. Do I Yorion? For anything? No. But we do elf. I'll have to discard one card, which could be a, a goose. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna end my turn. Discard a goose. Okay. <clears throat> I didn't want to draw too much, and have to discard a bunch of stuff. Man, this deck draws cards like there's no tomorrow. Oh come on! Uh. Hmm. All righty then. Um, yeah. Nope. Oh stage of the game I think I'm just putting threats on the board because he's down to five I got I need to kill him wolf and that's
that's lethal on the board. We have answers in hand. Go. Here's a 2-2 kitty blocker. And another blocker. Too bad I got answers for all of it. This game too. God, 16 minutes. Anything different I could have done. Finishing light on top of them. <clears throat> and he didn't put anything on the board threatening enough. Okay. From the video I did yesterday, I am just being reinforced that this Vanishing Light is so so much better than Glass Casket. I think I like Glass Casket in the sideboard, right where it's at. Ready to food. You gonna shoot something? Yep. That's fine. Fine. Shoot my food all you want. Not my food, but my goose. Shoot my goose. give him the potential 3-3 three, three just yet so we're just gonna banish him light it and get it out of here 
Charming Prince is carrying the team. care of that. Okay. What do we do here, folks? Trade, I'll trade. Good. That's fine. So next turn I can fight something. Or if he puts more enchantments in play. Ugh. If he puts more enchantments in play, I got act responses to that. So, I don't know if that's the best play, but I feel like it's what I want to do. And then I can bring Wolf out next turn and fight something, depending on what he puts in play. Yeah. So this is just like a Boros mid-range. Yeah, we could be in a little bit of trouble here. So the Skyclave will come back and get the seasoned hallow blade wicked wolf fights winota either way i'm going to go to 7 i'm going to i'm going to take 7 go to 6 but the wolf is still alive for the turn after that yeah I think that's my best line. I hate that it taps the wolf. trail all right so I'm gonna go to six Thank you. 